Pumpkins may not be one of San Luis Obispo County's most valuable crops, but this time of year the gourds are stealing the sales spotlight. KSBY News reporter Asia Gore joins us live in San Luis Obispo with more on how well pumpkin farmers are doing this season. Good morning, Asia. Good morning, Christina. Pumpkins are to many people a symbol of the harvest season, and whether you're picking your pumpkin for carving or making a pie, well, there are at least seven locations across the Central Coast where you can do a lot more than simply select your gourd. It's just a local tradition to look at all the different pumpkins and the varieties. Even on an 82 degree morning at the Avila Valley barn, Ann Hilbert and her two boys are in the fall spirit as they shop the more than 50 varieties of pumpkins. Oh my gosh! We grow about 200,000 pounds of pumpkins. And everyone has their favorites. These. These things. <laughs> at between 49 and 79 cents per pound, Avila Valley Barn stands to rake in some green from these orange gourds. And on weekends, you know, we could see anywhere between two to 4,000 people a weekend. This season is prime time for pumpkin farmers, but profits don't rely solely on the sale of pumpkins, which don't even make the list of top crops in San Luis Obispo County. In the 2018 Slow County Annual Crop Report, Pumpkins were filed along with carrots and melons, among three dozen other types of produce, under miscellaneous crops for a combined $112.5 million in gross value. Brookshire Farms co-owner Sean Calloway says despite a solid season of rain, creepy crawlies are causing problems. This year's been a little bit more of a challenge. We've noticed a lot more insects in our, in our pumpkins. We try not to spray anything here on Bookshire Farms area. The hay rides, duck races, and pie sales are essential supplements to what Callaway calls the agri-entertainment industry. And that whole package is just what Hilbert and her boys are after. Our weather here is pretty warm, so this is, feels like a fall activity. Pumpkins and you know, doing the hay rides and just enjoying this you know, time of year. And Callaway with Brookshire Farms believes pumpkin production in most places is down this year, but he does say he anticipates the pumpkins will last throughout the rest of the season. Live in San Luis Obispo, I'm Asia Gore, KSBY News. And Avila Valley Barn is open from 9 to 6 p.m. daily, and Brookshire Farms in Los Osos is open from noon to 6. I still need to get my pumpkins. It's just kind of hard to get into the no, fall spirit. Yeah. Don't do it today. Yeah, <laughs> but it's Maybe so skip it hot. today. Right? Yeah.